What happened with the real estate market in Sunny Isles and Aventura in September? Stay tuned for the next few minutes for more details. My name is Arthur and I've been living and working in the Sunny Isles Beach area and running a real estate business for over 10 years. I want to share some information and tips here on my channel. In my last videos, I analyzed and talked about the comparison of closed sales in Sunny Isles and Aventura for the months of July and August. And now we're going to continue looking at the trends and comparing August and September to see which way we're heading. Let's recap on the updated numbers for August sales in Sunny Isles Beach. There were 34 units sold up to 500,000, 19 units from 500,000 to a million, and 27 units from 1 million and up, totaling 80 units sold in Sunny Isles Beach for the month of August. Now let's look at the sales in the month of September. These numbers are based on the reports of closed sales as of October 7th. There were 21 units sold up to 500,000, 20 units sold from 500,000 to a million, and 24 units from 1 million and up, totaling 65 units sold in Sunny Isles Beach for the month of September. This is about a 20% drop from the month when comparing the two months. Now let's recap the updated numbers for sales in Aventura for the month of August. There were 62 units sold up to 500,000, 33 units from 500 to a million, and 11 from 1 million and up, totaling 106 units sold in Aventura for the month of August. Let's look at September sales in Aventura. These numbers are based on the reports of closed sales as of October 7th. There were 49 units sold up to 500,000, 31 units from 500 to a million, and nine units sold from 1 million and up, totaling 89 units sold in Aventura for the month of September. This is about a 15% drop month over month. There is a similar drop in sales in both Sunny Isles and Aventura, and this is a good indicator that the market is continuing to cool. We are starting to get into the peak season, and it will be interesting to see if the sales numbers keep going down or start to go up because of the influx of more people coming down. I wanted to share this information with you so you can have a better idea of what is going on in the market. Please check my video early next month. I will be doing analysis for the months of October compared to September. I hope this video was helpful, and if you have any questions, please feel free to leave your comment or reach out to me directly. Also, please subscribe to my channel to continue receiving useful information and tips about the market in Sunny Isles and South Florida. Thank you.